Hey everyone, this is video number two in a series of 12 workout videos that I've put together to bring you through an entire month of your fitness routine. Because this only covers three days a week, I'd like you to get out another two days a week and work up a sweat for at least 20 to 30 minutes. You can take a jog, a hike, a walk, whatever it is that gets your heart rate up. I assume that you've already done your warm up by stretching or doing some body weight exercises or even a jog around the block. Just make sure that you're nice and loose before you begin any workout. I want to talk to you quickly about safety, mainly about working through pain. So it was a bad idea that if you're in pain to exercise that particular muscle. For instance, yesterday I did a pretty heavy upper body workout with my trainer, Chris. So today I'm going to take it easier here and in my personal workout to make sure that I don't injure myself. If I get injured, then I'm stuck and laid up and I'm undoing everything that I've done in the weeks before. Also, you may notice that I wear gloves and that's to protect my hands from calluses from the weights. And also because when you get sweaty, you have the increased risk of slipping and dropping weights. And then sneakers, always make sure that you have a good tight fitting, well not too tight, but a nice fitting sneaker to work out in. Um, I like to use a cross trainer and I replace my sneakers every four to six months. And you can gauge that on the amount of activity that you do. Um, for today's workout, we're only going to need dumbbells and a yoga mat or a pad to protect yourself when you're doing your floor exercises. I want to keep the equipment to a minimum so that everyone's able to do this kind of stuff at home. And we're going to move right into the strength segment now. <clears throat> First, we're going to do what's called the bench over row. You'll notice that I have a series of different dumbbells on the floor today because depending on the exercise, I like to use different weights. Um, some are gonna be harder than others, so I would suggest that you do the same. I'm gonna use lighter dumbbells later and you'll see why. <laughs> it's gonna be a little bit harder. Now with these workouts, even though they're numbered one to 12, you can skip around and pick and choose what you wanna do that day. Just be advised that as the number gets higher, some of the exercises are going to become more advanced. So let's start with the bend over row. You're going to put one leg out in front of you like a lunge and make sure that your knee doesn't come in front of your toe because then you risk knee injury or extra strain on that joint. I'm going to bend over in a tabletop nice straight position, shoulders back, chest out. And I'm going to simply lift the weight up to chest level and drop it back down. I'm going to do this for a count of 12 to 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15. Now for the other side. Now remember to keep nice controlled movements, no jerking and don't move too fast. And I also like to contract my abs while I'm doing these exercises and that helps me build my core at the same time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 12, 13, 14, 15. The next exercise we're going to do, and I'm going to use little weights for this because my chest is killing me today, is a squat into a lateral raise. So you want your feet Shoulder width apart, knees nice and loose. Don't bend them backwards or lock them. And we're gonna go squat, and as we're going down, we're gonna bring our arms up to chest level. So from the front, it's gonna look like this. And then from the side, push that butt back. Make sure those knees aren't coming in front of your toes. And your shoulders nice, and straight and push back. So we want to do this for 10 to 12 count. It's a little more advanced 
and it's working several muscle groups at the same time. Let's try five more of these. Five, four, three, two, and one. For the last part of the strength segment, we're gonna do a static wall squat. This exercise is always hard on me. My upper body is stronger than my lower body, but I still gotta do them, because you don't want that imbalance. So for this, if you've worked up a sweat already, I'm gonna put a towel up against the wall. I'm gonna put my feet out, slip the way a little bit, my feet out in front of me. And I'm gonna end up with my legs in a 90 degree angle. And I'm just gonna hold this position for as long as possible. Our goal today is just 30 seconds. You're gonna feel this burn. Make sure not to hold onto your knees because that's gonna make the exercise too easy. And then keep that back nice and flat against the wall. Contract those abs and hold yourself nice and still. Remember to breathe through all these exercises. Get yourself in that nice mental zone where you're working past the burn, because these are gonna burn in your quads, especially. That's the third exercise of the strength segment. Now in between, keep the heart rate up. We're gonna do some push-ups. So I'm gonna put my mat down. And I'm going to show you two versions because push-ups are hard. So we can do a traditional push-up on the floor, which is just your hands shoulder width apart, body nice and straight, and we're going to go straight down. push-ups in between each one of these rounds for a total of three rounds. Now, if that push-up is too difficult for you, you can do a modified push-up, which is your knees on the floor, hands same position, body nice and straight, and we're just going to lower ourselves that way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and that's 10. Now remember to repeat these exercises three times for a total of three rounds. And that brings you through the entire first half of your workout. Not so hard. Remember always to breathe and stay hydrated during your workouts because you're losing fluids through your sweat. And it'll help with muscle recovery. Don't gulp, but sip your drink. <laughs> 